Thanks for joining me. We have uh, Espresso Tycoon Prologue, the Underwater Cafe. This will be my second um, demo playthrough that we've done. We played uh, through your first shop, basically. Uh, and I had some critiques. It was a little uh, slow going, so you got easily, I don't want to say the board word, but I did lose interest for a little while there, and I played on my phone. <laughs> Alright, um, mission targets have 1200 in cash, pay off your no loan, and have three awareness billboards. Employees, um, is not on the schedule. Alright, and then what you do is you put them on the schedule. Trying to set a schedule. All right, uh. let's put him there for first night. All right. Happy with those. There, money. Either. All right, you can design your own coffee, Oop, which is actually pretty fun, uh, but we're not going to do it right now because we're broke. We're broke. Supplies. Oh, this guy prefers. Uh, can't change. The period of time right here where we need someone. So employees. All right, let's get this guy right here. Oh wait, higher. Uh, machine Get rid of that All right, I didn't I didn't do the tutorial again cuz it was actually still pretty fresh in my head of how to play felt comfortable with uh, not <laughs>
There's an NPC that says, let's let Lori. And she gets cut off, whatever she's saying. like my working hours. Uh, my salary here is fine. There we go. Get the hours fixed. Even though I think there is going to be like two hours where there's no coverage, but nothing I can do about it. <laughs> Now that we have the milk frother, I can add that and add that. Um, oh, yeah. I also remember. Decorations. Got a little stuck in the zoom in position. <laughs> And if I remember right, yeah, you have to like repair furniture. But interesting enough, I just noticed that you now have different types of people. Uh, Starfish Martha. Here's Martha. She was the real star a few years ago. She liked singing and acting, and she always wanted to act in a musical. But her dancing career was over when she stepped into the weird, smelly, and metallic substance in the ocean. She can't dance like a ballerina right now. She's growing algae. Popular hobby here, and she's cheering her son Steve and fulfilling his dreams. What? This is Jenny. You have to know that she really knows what multitasking is. Sometimes she does so many things that you can think that she has four, six, or even eight arms. 
but even with eight arms, she's hopeless in saving the whole ocean from the trash that lands there. She has a friend, Mark, and she secretly wants him to invite her somewhere. She heard about the people, Zoo, you can see some creatures in the dome and observe what they're doing. She started to swim nearby, wishing Mark sees her and asking her out for a cup of coffee or something. Meet Steve, the most popular starfish here. The word star is not a coincidence. He likes to show off, always has to be in the spotlight, and has a unique skill of teleportation. He recently started to show a skill to the weird creatures inside the glass. He hopes they take him in a, uh, to a real holly water, or anywhere where there are no nets and plastic bags lying nearby. Okay, now, now we just need to find more. This is Sheila. She likes swimming. That's what sharks do, right? And reading books. She's really mad because someone threw trash in her backyard. She grew algae there for the past five years. Some of them were very expensive. She grew it to cover the cost of her son's nose operation. Not plastic surgery. Plastic is a big no-no for her. She feels proud she showed the problem to the tasty creatures in the dome. She hopes they help them somehow. That doesn't make you feel pretty crappy. It's all a fish I see anyway that I can click on. Hopefully I don't regret that and we run out of money. Oh, turtle, turtle! Tina the turtle, very calm and humble. She doesn't like the noise. She has a brother, Tim, and she always tries to protect him not easy. You should have heard the story about the plastic web. She has a crush on Steve the starfish. But please don't tell anyone. Your secret is safe with me. God, I don't think I actually can even afford it.
That's Steve, right? And then this is Martha. Checking. Uh, this is Mark, Mark the Shark. He likes football, or should we rather say finball here. What's more, his nose is broken. There's a story. He was playing hide-and-seek in the old wreck with his friends, and for a tiny moment, he closed his eyes, and he crashed into an old chest. Unfortunately, the vet said that the operation would cost a lot of money. I am curious of how it's going to get here. In the previous game, uh, it was dropped by um, drones. Tim the Turtle, funny, jokes a lot. He's cool and he likes dancing. His friends told him that break dance is the best for him. You know, swirling on the shell would be easy for a turtle. But no, he wanted to try salsa. He was very passionate, so passionate that he didn't notice the plastic web nearby and he got trapped. Fortunately, a dolphin, Stacy, rescued him from this life-threatening situation. This is John. He is already quite old. He just wants to swim in peace. That's why he doesn't like these weird changes here down in the ocean. He recently wanted to invite his friend Sheila for a cup of coffee or something, but he couldn't. His favorite spot became fully netted by an old f uh, fishing net. He is so lost, and he so lost his perfect room for these meetings. And so now he feels he doesn't have a place to be anymore. Stacy is a really smart dolphin. She knows things. For example, she knows that it's better to stay away from Mark and Sheila, even if they seem nice. They're still sharks, right? Stacy is a bit loud and not everyone likes that. Her best friend is Tim the turtle because he's so hilarious. Stacy helped him get out of a plastic web once, and that's kids how she met a new friend. I'm trying to decide or figure out I'm looking see if there's any anybody else but I don't think so <laughs> oh here it is it is a drone I'm not seeing rubbish. Where is the rubbish? Oh.
All right, I think I'm gonna go ahead and stop here. It is, how do, it, it gets pretty repetitive in the play and uh, I don't mind the game at all. Uh, as far as the demo goes, I think it's pretty adorable. I just wish that there was a little bit more action that was happening uh, because yeah. But uh, yeah, thanks guys for keeping me company and I will be back soon.